Welcome ladies and lords to another Tandem Yeti video where today we have a slightly creepy video, not really but a little bit, uh, because I will be reacting to Antiseptikai. Uh, I love Antiseptikai, he's really clever, uh, he's really um, well made and edited, uh, loads of different things. And if you're watching this video, then you probably know who he is, so I won't explain. And if you don't know who he is, then you probably know by the end of the video, I guess. Um, so, the reason I make this video, I have seen him before, uh, many times. Um, the reason I'm reacting to him now is because I know there's a few things that I, haven't, I probably haven't seen. I haven't seen every single little edit thing, and uh, I thought I can kind of talk to you what I interpret of everything that's going on and I think it will be um, really fun to uh, experience the antiseptic eye together because he hides so many clues and different things in his videos and um, I don't know how long this part will be I don't know whether I'll react to this whole video um, or whether I will um, or whether I'll do it in bits or uh, I, I don't know uh, but uh, I do know that uh, I will leave the link to this video in the description if I remember. I probably will, so it will be there if you want to check it out for yourselves. Uh, without further ado, uh, let's begin uh, watching. So uh, I'll just play the intro to the guy to give credit to the guy that put this compilation together. So here we go. <laughs> cool intro. Here we go, what's this? This is the very, the very first appearance of Antiseptic, I believe. Oh, for hours now. It's 5.35am and there's not much I can do. Here's the thing. The second- Yeah, what this was, I think this was a, um, a video that he did. He didn't have, he had like a thousand subscribers or something, I don't know. He didn't have many subscribers and he did this kind of little creepy pasta read along. And then people kind of looked at it and went, ha, that's kind of funny, it's kind of like a creepy Jack Sibley and they found it quite funny. So they were like, they kind of made a character out of the creepy Jack Sibley I don't think it was intention, I think it was just an interesting video. Uh, but then the fans, I mean, what I love most about anti is that it was actually the fans that built, like, the building blocks for him himself. And then it, all Jack Sibley had to do was... Um, kind of build on it and make it, which is really clever. Unless he's real, <laughs> um, who knows? Um, but uh, yeah, I I don't know whether what came first. I don't know whether dark applier was a thing before that, and then people were like, "Hey, this is like dark applier or not?" I think that that's somewhere. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. I think dark applier came first, though. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Can I make any hint that I'm not asleep anymore? I'm completely fucked. I will die, and there's nobody around to save me. Show us the dead bodies you hide be- That's creepy. Now this is what I consider to be the, the proper birth of, of antiseptic. I think this is what, what people mostly consider uh, for the birth of uh, anti. Uh, and the reason being uh, is because he kind of, this is when everybody kind of recognised it, and he made like a funny, creepy joke, and then everyone was like, wow, this is mad, it's like, Jack said the guy's gone evil, and they made a proper alter ego, and this is where it kind of really hit off, I believe. Um, Behind the curtain. You're not allowed to see the dead bodies. No one's allowed to see the dead bodies. It's just like, <laughs> it's a really creepy kind of joke, but uh, everyone, I think it's a, I think it was a joke, I don't know, but everyone uh, caught on and kind of, everyone was like, wow, that is, um, that, that is mad, and I love the way, the way it happened, like that, you just witnessed the birth of, um, anti-Semitic eye, and by, by the way, I probably won't be pausing all the time, I'm just going to be pausing on kind of, uh, the interesting ones, and the first ones are very interesting, so that's why I've been pausing a lot recently. Uh, we're only 34 seconds in this video that I'm reacting to, and 4 minutes through, so we'll probably have to do it in bits, but I don't know. And then, uh, this is kind of, the, this, I believe, is the split personality kind of ego part of thing that it isn't actually, they're kind of saying that they're different people. 
It's because we have split personalities. No, we don't. Yes, we do. Stop telling him that. Shut up. It looks like he's completely developed from the last one to now. He he was kind of calm before, and then now he's shouting really loud and talking and loads of stuff. Like, yes, we do. No, we don't. It's really <laughs> really clever the way there's different characters going on. You try getting some damn sleep with that going inside, going on inside your head all the time. Who's Sean? Just some crazy guy I keep locked away. Back in the basement! I don't even have a basement! <laughs> that was, I don't even have a basement! <laughs> oh, that was so funny. I could watch that all the time. It was delighting me. Put a smile on my face. Uh, it's so funny. So good. But this is like the proper, like, um, Five Nights at Freddy's. This is like the first time you actually see Antiseptico like, proper in flesh. This video. Um, which is really cool. Uh, I should probably watch the whole video sometime. Um, and what I uh, and what I found cool is that recently he actually made a Five Nights at Freddy's VR video, like much further in the future, uh, where he had in the background the blackboard and it had the date that this video came out, which is a cool little reference to Antiseptico, which is really clever. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red. There's the glitch. Oh, we just saw the glitch. That's exciting. I bet that was the first time people saw the glitches that happened. And they were like, oh my god, what was the glitch? I can't remember not knowing who Antiseptic I was. I can't remember what my first experience of him was. I can't remember, like, how I reacted to him without knowing who he was. I m that must have, must have been so weird. I must have been like, what on earth is going on? Button shock. <laughs> Cheer up, baby! Is this sister location? It is sister location. So wait, is it the first time Anti said the guy appeared in Sister Location? I didn't realise it was that early on. I thought it was later. I thought the first time he appeared was like um late like late I thought it was like the very like normal uh, uh Five Nights at Freddy's games. I didn't realise it was Sister Location. I remember watching through that series and I don't remember seeing Anti. I don't know, maybe I've forgotten. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button. There you go. Jock. <laughs> Cheer up, baby! Here! Zap! Whoa! That's clever. I like the way he's like in different modes and something there for a second. Just enough for you to kind of tell what's going on, but not completely. So it looks really creepy and weird because you don't know exactly what it is. And it's really clever the way he kind of edits it in, but then he continues. I don't know. It's, I don't know how he does it. It's really good. And then the kind of Robin does it. I think they work together. I like to believe that. Jack said because like, oh, I want this to happen, and then Robin does it. I kind of, uh, I don't think it's just all Robin's idea. I'm pretty sure they talk and communicate with what they want going on. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, it's, there's a creepy noise down as well. What fuck? I remember, I remember playing this game actually uh, myself, and it's my favourite Five Nights at Freddy's game by far. It's so interesting, so many different things you have, we can walk around and stuff. It's really fun. Jesus Christ! Whoa, the glitch then, the kind of, the light on his face is so weird. I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it play for a bit, because it's gonna take forever. Stay up, which is nice. That was <laughs> Oh my goodness, that one was mad. That one was mad, he was like stretching his face and stuff, that was, that, that was a mad one. I can't, I really want to go back to like watching these videos for the first time. That would be amazing to react to it for the first time. Unfortunately, I can't, unless I wipe my memory. Fuck back there, or I fuck you back there. Wait, re what happened to his voice? That that was a weird. That wasn't even Auntie's voice. That was a weird, deep voice. Really have to do all of these. Wait, no music. <laughs> the temptation to sprint is huge. Weird baby laughter. Hey, he's done the shift. Well, the more good. you know. Whoa, there's a little thing on the top left corner fucking descent into madness Scared. and depression oh because I'm not getting paid enough. <laughs> oh, but thank you I guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face! The the video. Like a buzz! And... Bye bye, all around. Thank you guys and I will see all you dudes! Hector. <laughs> Whoa, we think it's ended and then suddenly you see that. It's amazing. Motion trigger. Fuck, they're fucking going all over the place! What's wrong with them? Whoa! That was weird, it's kind of shining. Whoa, that was... Okay. I don't know, I, it's gonna be kind of be the same... How are you even running around? You don't even have any legs! Kind of the same. Come on! 
press the large black button Shut! beneath Bonnie. What's making noises? I'm not seeing anything. Whoa, who's seeing anything? Like this episode, if you like it, that punch that like button in the face. Oh my god, boys! And... Hi, boys, alright! Thank you guys, I will see all you dudes! Whoa! Top of the morning, Johnny's! My name is Axel and Welcome back There's to so Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. location! So... So many. Thing. I wonder, though, if you were a freshly opened pint of ice cream... That was weird! How you would feel? About something with that was weird. Jesus fucking Christ! What's happening? We just kind of need to collapse in the chair. Um, Laura? The laughter is so creepy. God damn, man. Fuck. Get off me, you bastards! So shaking loosens all these as well? Well, that's a bunch of boo Is anything huh? gonna happen? There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, he's actually talking! Is that the shit. first time he's talked? I am. Oh, that's the first time that, like, that's when he arrived. Oh, that's amazing. I died! Whoa. You don't leave, you don't put a flat piece of ground right before an, an, an exit screen so with funny. a gap. Um, oh, so those two dudes who were there. Oh. The two dudes from last- He makes me want to like, not look at the game and actually look at the face cam. Which is really clever because people don't look at the face cam all the time, but now when he does stuff like this, it makes people look more intently at the face cam more than the game. It's pretty weird. Because I haven't watched the game hardly, I've just been watching his face cam. And when I do watch the game, I always miss some something. It really annoys Snipe from night four? Boom! <laughs> Um, see all you dudes! Here we go. I don't know why I want to watch this series again, because this series was amazing. This is my name is Jack Slipkin, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location! It's on site today. Oh yeah! Try to avoid interfering with their work if possible. Also, feel free to ask them why- The ones who is like, moving his head around, like, it's, it's, it's so clever. I'm going to be saying that a lot- in these videos, I'm so pleasant to say that. They are still there. Hello? The HGI. He has the HGI in Bio Redemption video thing. Great. Now let's check on Funtime Foxy. Oh, the two technicians are hanged! Wait. It looks like everything is as it should Whoa. be in Funtime Auditorium. <laughs> Your task to <laughs> bodies on the stage. Who hanged them? Was it Baby? Did she do it? I know she did it. Wait, is that. Okay. There is something bad. Inside of me. I'm broken. It's like she said there's something bad inside of me and then and then there's something bad inside of Jeff Septic Kyle, like the antiseptic guy jumps out. That's clever. Aren't we all, baby? This will send me to the scooping room. Oh, I don't want you to get scooped! <laughs> it's haunting sounds. Haunting sounds it's not it's not only the game that's making this haunting sound. Technicians will take it from there. God, it scared shit out of me again. A goodbye. Can you hear me? I'm pretending. Remember how That's I so said. weird. Like he's just watching a gameplay video. Imagine if this is the first video I watched of him, and then suddenly while he's playing, just that happens. Well, wow. I'd love to see people's reactions to so. that. Could pretend. The cameras are watching. I must be careful not to lose. Well, that was a, that's a long one, this yesterday. one. Okay, I'm gonna follow what she says this time. I didn't realize that Sister Location was that long ago he had his green hair. I thought Sister Location was quite recent. Weird. There's a lot of that kind of glitch and going up the screen as well. I mean, I started doing this because Auntie's kind of, there's been kind of hints recently in his videos, he's kind of gone off a bit now, but last week there's been hints and stuff, uh, as of making this video. A baby in her room. So I'm excited, I'll be really excited when he appears. Room. So that, on each night, this is awesome. The kind of- It's really bothers to make the effect. Glitchy, weird shit that's going on. <laughs> yeah, well, he's saying that's awesome, glitchy, weird stuff. Bit boastful there, aren't you? Very cool. There you go. Oh, oh, feels so good. Oh, it's an after video. Right. 
There we go, I think I've finished all the sister location ones, so I think I will do it for this video, I will continue on watching this video through the next one. Uh, the Temple of No is up next, Temple of No is uh, amazing, it's made by Crows, 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 which is one of my favourite creators company in the world, and they're working currently to make uh, the Stanley Parable Orchard Deluxe Edition. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video everyone, uh, it's kind of weird me reacting to a different YouTuber, a bit weird, but... It's a little bit fun, uh, so thank you for watching everybody, I hope you enjoyed it, because if you didn't, then you've just wasted about 15 minutes of your life. Quick watching, goodbye!